goals. What have I done to make the world a better place? Sometimes the biggest challenge is taking the first step and believing that the actions of one person can truly make a difference. That's why we celebrate the honorees in our individual category. At any age and at any scale, we each have something to give. The stories of our individual honorees make that abundantly clear. Here to present the finalists for our individual category is Jennifer Sneed of the Midtown Memphis Rotary Club. Our first award is the Individual Youth Award. My name is Logan Gulliff. I'm 17 years old. I won Mass Chef Junior and I'm a chef. I don't really have any formal training. I don't have a private chef. I don't really work in any restaurants. You know, before Mass Chef Junior, I was really just alone in a kitchen with mom and I created my first recipe when I was eight. And I created my spice balloons when I was 10. I met President Obama and ate in the White House. But when I was 11 and I was on the show, that's when like, it was really crazy. That was when like everything started becoming like more than just, I'm a kid in Memphis, I'm doing cool stuff, I'm working at a soup kitchen, I'm creating recipes. But after Master of Junior, that's when like everything really got big and I got start, started to get asked to do these charity events. Since then, in the, in the like five years, you know, it's just been, like a steady fifth stream of just like interesting and cool things. Like I've gone and I've judged the Young Chef Olympiad in India. And that was one of those experiences where I was like, oh my God, what I do here in Memphis can, can really go global. You know, it's just one of those incredible things for me because I take a lot of pride in it and I really love Memphis and Memphis uh, supported me when I was little and, and continues to support me now. And in that sense, you know, I don't think that I can do what I do anywhere else. I don't think that like if I was in like New York or I was in like LA or I was in like Chicago, it'd be the same. You know, I wouldn't have that, that grittiness. You know, Memphis has a little bit of grit and grind in it. And that grit and grind helps me get through a lot of my work. For me, working with nonprofits is so big. It started with the soup kitchen and I, I was working down in St. John's, like really close to my house. And then I kept working and I just started the Real Men Wear Pink campaign and that's going pretty well. And I've also done Dishes for Wishes in Nashville. I've done um, just all these different charities, just tons of them. And I've done ones up in, up in New Jersey. I've done them in Roanoke. I've done them just everywhere. And I try and work with all of them because, you know, there's always somebody to help. And there's always, like, someone to work for. And I'm going to help raise money and raise awareness for this big issue and this big cause. There's the young chef, Logan Gulliff, receiving his Spark Award. The second award